Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight's dinner, I'm making a um, red curry um, chicken. So, um, let's get started. So I'm gonna pour, make sure I read this right. All right, so I'm gonna do one. I'm pour one of these in here and let this boil. And my heat is on high, so we're going to let this boil. I'm going to put both of them in, so there's one. Now, if you guys want to know how to make this recipe, then you guys know where to find it. You guys know where to go to my channel. It's really, really thick, but we're not, it's not, I don't think it's going to really affect anything. We're just going to get out as much as we can. It's all about some easy cooking, easy home cooking. And I got to tell you. This recipe is going to be a good recipe. So hopefully um, you guys like this video. So there's two. So you see as much as you can. Alright. I'm going to let this boil. Make sure I get all of that. Alright, so I'm going to give it a mix, mix it again. So, mix it. So, for, so, for this recipe, you guys need one, it's one cup of water, and for a family of uh, five, you're going to need two packets of this. So, right, let that boil. While that, while that boils, uh, And to serve, to serve on top of this, you guys can do any starch you like. We're doing white rice with this. White, man, white rice, white, white rice with this recipe. So that's always good. <clears throat> um, what we're going to do is once this boils, let me. Um, there is chicken that goes into this. Um, I got an assistant who's cutting up my chicken right now, so that's always good to have. It's good to have, it's good to have two people in the kitchen helping you, or good to have a, a, a person helping you in the kitchen make a little faster, but this recipe is really good. And you guys know to go to my channel for all the videos. I do have some good videos, but I think this video will actually be the best video. Um, only because it is... I've never made it before, so we're going to see how it goes. And like I said, it's only one cup of water, so if you can see in the pan now, there's like little bubbles forming. So that's obviously going to be a good thing because it'll start to boil. So once you see those bubbles, you'll know that we're in a little bit of a good place. Um, we have our chicken in. We have our packets in. Letting this thing boil. And if you guys don't... Um, if you guys don't want to um, make it with rice, you guys can make anything you want. Um, you could do pasta, you could do anything, just, we're just doing it with rice, so it's just what it recommends. Oh, and I'm going to tell you guys something else. Next weekend I'm doing a slow cooker video, so look out for that recipe too. That's going to be another video I'm going to do next weekend. That video hopefully is good too. Um, it's going to be really good. We're doing a slow cooker hash next weekend. So, guys, if you guys want to see that video, you guys know where to find it. All right. We're almost there with our boil. Getting there. It smells delicious, guys. Trust me. This is going to be one good dinner. And most of the um, most of the recipes that I have on my channel are really good. They just, I think, this recipe hopefully is good. And I'm hoping that it will, will get a lot of subscribers and I want to give a shout out to my best friends out there because you guys were asking you guys were like are you gonna post uh, another cooking video and I'm like yes I'm gonna post a lot of them so I want to give a shout out to Zane who's been my best friend for a long time so thank you Zane for recommending me making this video all right we're almost there guys we're just getting there and like I said you guys um, with the water you guys only want to do a cup because what a cup does is it boils really quickly so it's also a good thing Real good. It smells good too. It just yeah. I'm gonna. So anyway, with this, I'm just gonna get a little stir. And like I said, what you guys wanna do is you wanna 
keep this stirred good. So I'm just gonna. Uh, but this recipe is easy and it does smell good, so you know, this is basically part of life. And most of the recipes I do are easy because they don't require me to do a lot of work. Um, some of the recipes, now if you guys remember like um, weeks ago I tried to do a big ZD and that didn't really go so well, but I think most of the slow cook recipes I do are easier if I just... Clear instructions, but this thing is smelling really good. So it looks good, smells good, and almost there. We're just gonna let this just boil up. And if you guys want to know how to make this recipe, you guys want to go to my channel because my channel, you guys know, I have all the um, great videos on my channel, and you guys know that. Obviously, go to my channel. Which, if you guys have seen my chick, my slow cooker or my slow cooker chicken parm video, you guys know that that video I did. And I'm gonna tell you the little secret that I um when I make my chicken parm. You guys remember from the chicken parm video when we had our when we had when we added our sauce to our slow cooker. Um, it was really really thick, so I had to get it all out, and it was easy too. So that video, I'm gonna. Maybe make again, but the video that um, I really want to um, show you guys in the future is dirty rice because the dirty rice video is good now. I can see it's boiling, so I'm just gonna. Alright, guys, so here's what we're gonna do next. Now, um, I'm gonna show you the rule about the chicken. Now, when you touch raw meat, you obviously gotta make sure you wash. Your hands when you deal with raw meat because of the salmonella. So, so we're just pouring in our chicken. Our chicken in. Okay. And this recipe is easy to make. It's not really that difficult to do. It's so easy. This is going to take the longest. So you know we're going to start now. Now the goal with this recipe is to get the chicken in that in that liquid, you know, like there's a lot of, there's quite a bit of liquid, so you want to make sure you get into that liquid submerged in there, pushing down the liquid, just letting it just sit in there, okay, so this recipe is easy, or, eat, this recipe is easy to make, so it's not really that difficult to make, it's so easy, and I know that now, if you guys like the video, you guys know to subscribe. And if you guys like it, maybe I'll make it again. Who knows? Alright, so I'm going to reduce the heat. So I'm going to turn it down. Now, let's turn this down a little bit. Now, the one thing that I will say is that... So now, we're going to go over to the next thing. Now I'm going to do my rest. So I'm going to turn the burner too high. And I'm going to wait for that to boil. So. Sorry, guys. There you go. All right, I'm going to start my rice. And the... Excuse me. Um, so... Well, like I was saying, this recipe is easy. So, if you guys want to see this video, you guys know to go on my channel. Easy. It's like easy cooking. Like, you can mess it up. So, like I said, we're not having rice with anything. Oh. So, I have a yeah. cup of um, instant rice that I'm going to pour into the pot once oh. it just like, starts to boil. Because, you know, it's not going to cook long at all. But, you know. But when you make this recipe, just be careful. Now, like I said, I, I will have all the measurements and all the stuff you need to make this recipe so you guys don't mess it up. Because some people mess things up when they're cooking. And I'm still learning a little bit. So we got a lot of time. Okay, we're good. We're, we're in a good spot. All right. Let our pot just... We're just going to let our pot just sit there and boil. Let's do this chicken up a little bit. Now... Um, when we, when I make, 
if I ever make this dish again, you guys gotta let me know if you wanna see, like, one of these dishes again, because this is, like, I hope it's good. I don't know if it's gonna be good, but I just hope it's good. Alright, I got that. If you guys wanna know, um, what I'm doing is I'm just multitasking. So I got my chicken mixture here, which is gonna be, like, my curry, and then I got my, what, uh, my water here. Hopefully this strikes the boil a little bit, so that way it'll... What the hell? This is the ranch. So, I'm gonna... And what you want to do is you want to make sure that your chicken is submerged in that liquid. Because if it's not, then, you know. Just let it submerged in the liquid. It's good. Now, um, this recipe is the easy, one of the easiest recipes in the world. All right, perfect. So the recipe is still going. Now, this recipe, you guys know that um, I I love I I love making food like this. But this recipe is new to me, so I've never made it before. So you guys are gonna have to let me know what you think in the pan. It's on a simmer. It's simmering now. So it's not, it's not boiling anymore. It's just on a simmer. It's just simmering gently. And I'm watching the water. Because this water has to boil before we can put our rice. And it's not, it's not a lot of water. It's like there's two cups of water in that pot. That's what you want. You want two cups. But the chicken looks good. It's, it smells, it smells, it smells really good. I'm Yes or no? Nice. Yes? Nope. You don't need to cry. Just going to get a stir. And this recipe is, it, it, now it's not done yet, but it smells good, so that's always a good sign. When you cook dinner, it starts to smell good. Just let it sit there, and the water just, the water's taking a little longer, but I ain't gonna worry about it. So the water's just sitting there, we've got our chicken. As you guys know, if you guys don't know how to make this recipe, you guys know how to go to my channel, to my channel. Now remember. The videos that I usually post to YouTube are cooking videos. Now, like I said, the next recipe we're gonna make is next weekend, which is our slow cooker video. So that that's gonna be a bonus. But I love I love doing slow cooker meals like that. Usually, when I do a slow cooker video, I like to just like kind of just you know just to do. Tablet time is over. Come on, come here. I just like to do a lot of videos, but they're. But they're pretty basic. But the video's easy. So we're going to let this just sit. <clears throat> and let me actually... Let me check this rice to make sure that I'm doing this right. Let's see. Alright, so that's good. So we're going to let this boil, and if you guys want to know how to make it, remember, the camera's still on. So as you can see, the pot is boiling. Well, it's not boiling, but it's simmering in the pot. And there, you can see the water here, it's starting to get a little bit bubbly. We want the whole thing to boil, so I can throw my rice in and get it cooking. But as you can see, you're probably asking me, you're like, what is this recipe based on? Now, I have trained you to the point where you got to make sure you keep your food stirred good, right? Pretty sure. Okay, so you want to make sure that you keep your food stirred good, and I'll give you a little secret. You want to make sure you taste it for seasoning. Now, most people say, oh, it's not necessary. You shouldn't taste your food for seasoning. Guess what? You should. So when you make, when you, if you guys want to know how to make this recipe, you guys know where to find it. All right. Mm. Very good. Okay, so the pot, we want the water to fully bubble away. So to get that happening, we have to let it boil first. And the pot is boiling back here, right here. See this? Now you probably can't see it, but you'll be able to see the water absorb into that liquid. Alright guys, 
so our water is boiling. So at this point, just turn, just pour the rice in the bowl, in the pot, and it's a lot, but it's fine. Now, it's not really going to make a difference. It seems to be fine. Just a little. I'm going to pour all that rice in. Bring it all on there. So just. And I'm going to turn this heat off. So what this does, now remember, it's not going to look, it's not going to look like this when it's turned off. It will, but it's going to cook by itself. Um, every grain sticks to itself. So if you want the perfect rice, you're looking at it right here. This is how I make it. All right. Heat, heat off. I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to cover it. I'm going to remove it. And I'm going to just let this sit back here and start cooking away. All right, but that takes five minutes. So five minutes, this should be done. That burner's hot, but I turned the burner off. And back to our curry. So it'll let that sit. We're not going to touch it. We're not going to do nothing to it. We're just going to let it sit. Back to this. So this mixture is really coming together. Now, it does take a while to cook. I will admit that. Now, like I said, this video is a very long video tonight because I'm making this Plus that, so it's a long video, but that's fine. All right, it's keeping it stirred good. Mm -hmm. Gonna simmer, so we wouldn't leave it like that. And if you guys want to know how to make this recipe, you guys know how to find it. Um, but this is a curry. It's basically what I'm making is a. It's a, excuse me. It's a royal Thai cruising. It's the Thai premium curry sauce, red curry. So it's basically a curry. And I did train you guys to the point where you should taste the sauce pleasing, so I know that. But, now, <clears throat> the important thing is, is to not stir it too much. Because what you're, what you're trying to get now is you're trying to get it to simmer down. You're trying to get it to simmer, so that way all the flavor. Because as you can see, the water, I'm going to show you something. See the water? Look at that water. The water is just boiling. That's what you want. You contain you want you want your thing to contain a boil like that. You want to just simmer in that pot, okay? All right. So let's talk about something else. Okay. So basically, what this recipe focuses on is it focuses is it, it's focusing on the recipe. I love to cook. Now, like I said, next weekend we're definitely gonna do another slow cooker video. Um, there's no shame in my game. I promise you guys, slow cooker video. We're gonna do it. Now this video is pretty long. So as you know, we got to sit here and talk about stuff. But you guys realize that when I make these kind of videos, that these videos are very interesting. So, and I, like I said, I've never had this kind of dish before. So we're going to see how it turns out. I'm pretty sure I did it good. Right now, it's just sitting here with a simmer. It's simmering in that pot. Um, basically, what you do... Alright guys, so look at the curry now. It looks good, doesn't it? So this video is basically a um, simple video. It's easy, it's quick, and I will show you guys what it looks like when it's done. Right now it's just sitting in there. And it smells so good. Like, you know what? Like, I wish you guys were here to smell this, because this thing smells amazing. But um, this is basically what you want your um, 